Say six and the third innings, uh, just what was working for you, what uh, what pitches were, were really working for you? Yeah, at the beginning I was throwing a lot of fastballs, mm -hmm. uh, a lot of sink. The the hitters were missing a lot the the fastball in. But when I worked outside, it was it was moving pretty good. And at the end, I was just throwing sliders, so many sliders. They were just swinging over it. Yeah. Um, did you kind of just want to get past that previous career long of six innings and just get one more batter, one more strikeout? Yeah, definitely. After the sixth, I went into the locker, into the dugout. I was like, damn, they can't take me out. I need to go out there. And yeah, they let me go in. Um, it's a strikeout. And I think Chris, you were part of a big second inning, three runs. So um, you were able to get the big hit and then also score on the throwing error and steal. Um, so talk about just being a part of that big inning, take the lead early. Yeah, just trying to you know move the runners over, keep keep us uh, move the runners over, keep uh, the streak going, like getting the runs in and just going base to base. And to hit a double and a triple tonight, you had to be seeing the ball well. Yeah, it felt good. Uh, making a lot of adjustments with the coaches. Uh, recently, I've been struggling a little bit, so just making the adjustments and it's nice to see when it pays off. And Enrique, how much do you like just seeing that three spot on the board, second inning, and uh, gives you a little bit of a cushion to work with? Yeah, definitely. I mean, if you can get a cushion right away from the start, third inning, you can play more with the pitches and it definitely helps. And you got out of a jam in the fourth inning with a couple strikeouts. What was the key to getting those two guys? Yeah, that was a big inning. I mean, sliders. No, I was throwing sliders. I think I threw probably maybe one fastball to those two guys. And, I mean, it was, it was working pretty good.